back to my channel and before I get into this video Merry Christmas everyone I know that I probably said it in the past three four videos but yes I hope everyone enjoyed their holiday season I know I enjoyed it and as you can see I have some gifts that I received that I want to share with you plus I have gifts that I purchased for myself that I'm going to share as well so just getting into this video the first thing that I'm going to I'm going to start with like the smaller stuff I went to Ulta and I have other items in this bag as well. But I went to Ulta and the first color I saw was the Copenhagen color. And I'm like, oh, Copenhagen. I have been wanting that color like some years ago when it was like really popular. If anyone remembers that, when everyone was like, you have to get this, you have to get it. This is how it looks. It's a uh, NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. It's three different lip creams in here. And the colors are Copen Copenhagen, Budapest, and Moscow. So it's like a really pretty burgundy, um, mauve pink, and a deep blue color. And that was the first gift. And I purchased this for myself. And also, my ColourPop order that I did not that long ago came in. So this is the card. And it says, you light up my life. XOXO ColourPop. And I got several things from them. One that I have on today, this is the Ariba lipstick. I don't have it near me, but this is Ariba's from the I Love Sarah 2 collection, if I'm not mistaken. But I got three brow pencils and two liquid lipsticks. And they have new brow pencils. This is just the Brow Boss by ColourPop. So I haven't tried any of these yet. I will be trying them soon. And, and... These are two of the lipsticks that I got. I got Zipper and I got Troublemaker. And I'll just show how those look. This is how they look. Troublemaker is kind of like a peachish orange color. And I needed another one just because my other one is starting to get low. And that's how it looks. And then Zipper, it's a really pretty purple, and I needed a really pretty purple lipstick. I have a purple, but it's not a matte liquid lipstick. And that's how it looks. I'm trying to get more into new colors and step outside the box a little bit with my lipsticks because I'm a true red girl, true burgundy, red, under, red undertones, any of that I love. Okay, I'm searching around for gifts. I'm going in no particular order. This is just a gift bag. This was from my family event, my family Christmas event yesterday. So this is from one of my aunts. And she got me this beauty blender from Mary Kay. And she also got me a gift card to Sephora. So I'm like, you know me very well because I love you can never have enough beauty blenders. And of course, Sephora is this card is about to get used probably today next i got an, a lotion this is maui hibiscus beach it's a body cream from bath and body works and that's just how it looks and this it really smells good put a little bit on that on right now It smells like, like you're at a beach. So this one, Bath and Body Works. I have gifts randomly around me. So if you see me here, 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 yeah. Next, I got this really beautiful scarf. And I love the colors of it. It's like plaid and it has like browns and cream and gray in it. And this is from another one of my aunts. And it has little tassels on it. And this was from Wilson's Leather. So that's how it looks. I also got some chocolate, some Ghirardelli chocolates here, which may get eaten today. And I got a green tea mask here. I'm like, so does everyone know about my obsession with sheet mask or like what's going on here? Because I don't think I've like told people that I love using sheet masks. I got two lipsticks from e.l.f. One is Bold Berry and one is Razzle Dazzle Red. But that's how they look. One is a moisturizing lipstick and one is a velvet matte lipstick. 
next I got and this was so cool to me because I was like I love pink and I love bath bombs I got two of them one is a sugared lemon and one is sunkissed guava and that's how they both look like I love these like I think I like the sunkissed guava better but it's so close because it smells so good like I want to just throw both of them in there but that'll be wasteful but it smells delicious like you know how something smells good that's not edible but you're like that smells good enough to eat that's how these smell and it's heavenly it's a mist and lotion set this is how it looks and it has a little sequins in the container I'm like I really like this I love cool packaging like this so yes I can't wait to open it up and get it but that's how it looks and it's gold you know I love my gold and rose gold next is I mentioned on Instagram a couple of months ago for all um for anyone following me but I did win a giveaway it was a YouTube giveaway and I will tag the YouTuber below but I did win her giveaway and I just entered it randomly I didn't have like oh my god I'm gonna win it I actually forgot that I entered it but I got an email from Yord Watches I think that's how you pronounce it Yord or Jord I think it's Yord but from Yord Watches and they, they told me that you congratulations you were the winner you have a hundred and eighty dollar voucher for whatever you want to get off the website and i was so excited about it because i love these watches i've always said that i wanted one but i just never got around to purchasing one for myself so this is how it looks when you open a box and let's just get into this packaging like this is so nice it's like a gift box and inside another box i just think that is so cool and before I show the actual item, it comes with this cloth to wipe it off. And it also comes with the um, preserved finishing oil for the watch. Because the watch is wooden. This is how it looks. It came in a wooden, a wooden box. And you just lift the top off of it. Like that. And this is the watch. Isn't that cute? Of course... Of course, I got the closest thing to pink on the website, and it's like a purplish pink color. Um, I can't remember the exact style that I got. It may be in the box, but this is how the watch looks. And this watch actually was a little over 180. It was like, um, I think it was like 190 something or something like that. I just paid the difference because I was like, I'm getting $180 free. Why not pay an extra 10 or $15 to get what I really want? And that's how it looks. And it has the little J right there. This is the, the Frankie series wash that I got. I chose to get it in December because I said why not get it during Christmas time but I won the giveaway a couple months ago and it has a storing compartment in the bottom of it a storing drawer for any like watch accessories or different things that come with it like I could put my cloth in there and I could put the finishing oil in there also the items that I got for my sister and brother that I'm about to show next so yes um the first purse I got is from Aldo and this is how it looks I love this purse I love the embroidered details all on it and I've been eyeing this purse for a while and I just never got it and I was so happy that I got it for Christmas and just take the plastic off you just open it like this and this is how it looks this is how the inside of it looks it does come well it's on crossbody strap so, and it has little pockets and zippers on the inside of it. Next in the bag, I have another purse from Aldo. <sighs> I know, I know. I don't need any extra stuff because I don't have anywhere to put my stuff that I already have. But this is my next Christmas gift. I love the details on it. And that's how it looks on the side. It feels like really smooth and soft. And the bottom is like a, a thick glitter feel. And I love the details of this one also. And it opens pretty much the same. 
it's a little different opening and this is how the inside of it looks and also it does have a crossbody strap as well the next pair are shoes like you all know my obsession for shoes if you don't know now you know but I sent this link to my brother because you know with guys you have to help them out you have to get them a little push because they will not get you what you want if you don't tell them so close maps don't get fed but anywho I got um these are some women Nike loading and these retail for $90 but these are the Nike loading and this is how they look I really think they're just like sporty and chic looking and that's the color of them. It's, um, I, I don't know if it's going to pick up the color, but it's royal blue, orange, and yellow. So I think this would be a perfect shoe for like summertime wear and different things. And that's just how it looks. This is how the bottom of the shoe looks. And I tried the shoe on already and it's super comfortable. I know I never really try shoes on before I get them. But just because I've never had this model before, I was like having to make sure I got them in a size 8 in women. And because, <laughs> because I love the shoes so much and I didn't want to be a little score bread this year. So I got him to give me one and I got myself another pair. Because if you like it, buy it in every color, right? But <laughs> this is the pair that I got myself. This is the green, red, and black color. And I'm like, I really love these. You probably will see me wearing these soon. Because it just, it has like a Christmas feel to it. And not only that, it has like a Black History Month or a Gucci feel to it. Just the colors of the shoes. So I really love these. I cannot wait to wear this shoe. This is how these look. I got these Zova brushes here. And this is the bag it came in. It's like a leather plush bag. And it has rose gold zipper and the name of it here. And I was so in love with the packaging of it. It's a... This is the 15 brush set here. And let me just pop it open. So I can pull them out. This is how they look. To take one of them, this is, this is the one to a face curve brush. I don't know if the camera is focusing in on it, but it does have it in rose gold. And on each brush, it has the name and what the brush is for and the number. And then on the back, it says color, love, makeup on the back of it. So I really like it. And just based off of it like these are really extremely soft so i'm interested to see do they remain soft after i clean all of them and they do come in this little plastic cover here and then also in a plastic slip i got several of them several brushes all in one pack this one is a stippling brush this is a fan brush I got a powder brush. They're all really soft. I got a lot of eyeshadow brushes as well. This is for a wing liner, which I need to get into doing more of. This is a spot liner brush. It's just so many in here. I really don't have to go through all of them. Um, Luxe crease brush. Smudger brush. Smoky eyeshader brush. A purchase that I definitely felt like I needed to make because I do tend to use the same brushes and having to constantly clean them can be a bit much at times and of course I have some makeup palettes in this video I got two Julius Place palettes this is a palette that I already own it's like my holy grail product it's the Nubian by Juvia's this is the first palette I got from Juvia's they made me really fall in love with their products and I'm sure everyone knows how it looks because I use it often in my videos. But I will show it just because. This is how it looks on the front. And on the inside. Because I hit pan on my last one. So for the most part, I'm finished with that one. So when I completely run out of it, then I'll start using this one. But this is the palette that I used to use for all my eyeshadow looks before I even started doing YouTube. And it has... The perfect mixture of nudes, 
um, shimmers and just matte looks for a great nude smoky eye look. So this is like a palette that I think it should just be a staple item because it has like every transition color you need in here for really any skin tone. And Julia's Place is a black owned business. And I will be doing more looks and black owned things in the next couple of months for February Black History Month. And then I got the Masquerade palette. I got it really because it was pink and it's just so pretty. I just think this is such a pretty palette. Isn't this just gorgeous? And the colors are just amazing in it. That's how the colors look inside of it. And all of them come with this plastic slip cover for the shadows. And I also love that they are named. This is the last item. Yes, I got it. Yes, I got it. It's the Modern Renaissance Palette. And this is a gift as well. I was so excited because I asked for it. I had been mentioning it and saying like, Oh, that Modern Renaissance Palette. Everyone has it but me. I'm the only one that doesn't own it. I need that in my collection. Someone needs to buy it for me. Like, I have been throwing out, out all these subtle hints, but not so subtle. And, yeah, I got it. And this is how it looks. I just love the packaging of it because it's like this velvet suede packaging. So, I'm like, I can just touch and rub this all day long. <laughs> I need to stop sharing my weirdness with you all. But, anywho... And this is how it looks on the inside. I will just hold the brush that comes with it. I've seen so many people create all these great looks with it. So, of course, I can't wait to create my own. It has a mirror at the top here. Oh, you can see my camera set up. <laughs> it has a mirror at the top. It says Anastasia Beverly Hills on it. And... Just from looking in here, red ochre is the color I hear everyone raving about. Like the Venetian red, I like real gar and burnt orange and raw sienna. Everyone always talks about raw sienna and red ochre. So, yeah. And I didn't really swatch it yet, but sooner or later I will be using it. Just checking out myself in the mirror. But, <laughs> and a bittersweet moment because we've come to the end of this video and yeah that's those are the gifts that i received for christmas including the gifts that i purchased for myself uh this is a season of giving so i did buy a lot of people gifts don't just think that i'm like gimme 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 no i really am truly a real deal giver i purchased a, quite a bit of gifts for a family and along with me and my family so we did purchase gifts and different things and so i do love christmas it's really probably my favorite holiday and i just can't wait to share more christmas videos with you all in the future and yeah and there will definitely be more to come christmas, i hope everyone had a great christmas i hope that you all received gifts let me know down below if you own any of these items already or if you receive some of the same items for christmas i want to know so let me know and also um i don't know if i'm going to be doing another video before the year ends we shall see so yeah happy new year to everyone hope everyone has a prosperous rest of the year and enjoy the new year coming in how are you going to bring in a new year what are you going to be doing i don't know what i'm going to be doing yet hopefully i'm doing something fun adventurous but if not i may be in church bringing in a new year it just all depends that's normally where i am but this year could be different so who knows but yeah so i hope that you all enjoyed this video remember to like comment subscribe and share my videos and i will see you in my next one thank you for watching mm -hmm.